Today, people affected by last month's floods made their way to the Lion San Diego office where they were met with lawyers and attorneys to plan a strategy to make sure something like this doesn't happen again in their community. People still working to recover from January's devastating floods were treated to a warm breakfast this morning. It came as they got together to learn more about resources and legal options available to them. To see if I can get any help because I'm already tired of promises and promises and promises. Alliance San Diego brought in the law firm Singleton and Schreiber to talk to flood victims who have questions and concerns. Just for them to help us, you know, like any way they can help us. Elmer Pineda lives in the apartment complex affected by the floods. Right now, his family is staying at a hotel. He said he's already pursuing legal action, but wanted to hear more. I don't know who needs to step it up, but they got to step it up and give us our help. Brett Schreiber of Singleton and Schreiber is letting flood victims know that they only have six months from the date of the disaster to file a claim with the government. So we intend to use litigation as well as political coordination with our community partners to not only ensure that this community gets rebuilt, but to ensure that this doesn't happen again in the future. A big worry some victims have is immigration status. This resident is one of many who have concerns because of their immigration status, but Schreiber says that's not a problem. Absolutely not. I want to be very clear about something. We have very good laws in California that protect people of any type of immigration status from bringing a claim in our civil justice system. For people looking to pursue legal action, Schreiber says some important things flood victims can do now is document. This includes mudlines and floodlines in their homes to essentially create a record of what everything looked like in their home. He also went on to say there is no class action lawsuit in the works currently. It is not. It's what we call as a mass action, which means each and every claim is worked up individually. He says every single claim rises and falls on its own merits because each claim is an individual person, family or owner. Along with legal help, the breakfast served as a time to discuss a strategy to push City Hall to invest in and maintain critical stormwater infrastructure. Esmeralda Perez, CBS 8.